Hello everyone, my name is Kishan. In this video, we are going to see how we can install external Python packages. As you can, as you can see on the screen, I am trying to use a package called CX underscore Oracle. This package helps you to connect uh, your Oracle database with your Python scripts so that you can run commands on your Oracle database via your Python scripts. But when I try to import this package, it gives me an error saying module not found error and it says no module name CX Oracle. Now, the reason that this error occurs is because we do not have CX underscore Oracle package installed in our system. If you have just installed Python, you just have the standard libraries, but there are lots and lots of third party libraries which will help you solve particular problems, such as pandas can be used for data analytics, Flask can be used to create REST APIs, and there are lots of others. Actually, I believe that Python is so popular these days because of these external libraries which help you to solve some particular problems very easily. So let's see how we can inst in install CX underscore Oracle. So first of all, you need to go to your command prompt. Over here, just write Python and it will take you to the Python interpreter. Let's try and import the module here. Now it can be any module. The way of importing any module would be same. And the way to install any of the external module is also same. So here, as it says, the module is not found. So I would ex exit the Python terminal and now I'll issue the command pip install and the package name that I want to. Here, the package is CX Oracle. Pip is the package installer for Python. Pip is used to install and manage software packages written in Python. Now you can use pip to install packages from the pack Python package index or any other indexes. So when you write pip install cx underscore oracle, it will try and find the pack package or module from the index. Over here it says collecting cx oracle, means it, means it has found the module. It will download it and install it. So now, as you see, it is saying installation uh, done and successfully installed cx oracle. Now if I go to Python terminal and import cx oracle, you can see it worked. Hence, this has successfully installed the Python package. Now, what if you want to install a particular version of the package? Say, suppose I want to install MySQL. Now, MySQL is used to connect to SQL, MySQL database. So, the syntax to do that would be pip install MySQL is equal to is equal to and the particular version. In this case, I want 0.0.2 .0 version. Now, if the package would already be installed, it will say something like this, requirement already satisfied and MySQL is present at this location, right? Now, this was about installing packages. What if you want to uninstall any particular package? The syntax to do that would be pip uninstall Let's uninstall the CX Oracle package that we just installed. CX underscore Oracle. It will ask you that you seriously want to do that. Just give Y and it will uninstall it. Let's give it a second. So it can, as you can see on the screen, it says that it would remove all this. It would remove now I have installed Anaconda in my system and hence it is going to the Anaconda path to do all those needed changes. Now this might take a while. As you can see, it has successfully uninstalled CX Oracle. Now if I'll go to Python and try to import it, it will say module not found. But what if there are lots of packages that you need to install? Now say suppose there are 10 packages. In that case, what you can use is you can do pip install hyphen r and just create a file with all the packages in it. I just created a file called requirements.txt and I mentioned two packages in it, flask and request package. Now you can just give pip install hyphen r requirement.txt and it will install all the packages 
that is that are named in the text file now you can name the file whatever you want but it looks like it's a standard to to create a requirement.txt file with all the required modules in it so this was a short video on how you can install python packages i hope you like the video please do share your thoughts in the comments this is kishan signing off thank you